Well, we're going on a little mission. For my love. Yeah. We're going to Cracker Barrel, but not to eat. No. While we were there last time with Tommy, I was looking at some of their handmade quilts, and these are real handmade quilts, like your grandmother, you know, the pioneers used to make. And I was over there, and they range from like 100, I think 129 up to over $200. And I saw one that I wanted, it was $150, so I'm going to get that one. It's a king size, so I'm going to get it. And, yeah, because um, she put one of her uh, other possible keepers up for sale. Yeah, I never took it out the package, yeah. so I just put it up for sale. It's so been I'll, in, I'll gain one, so I'll sell one. Yeah, so this is actually has been in, a, in its own package for a couple months now. Yeah, it's, it's been there for a while. Yeah, I kept looking at it, I was like, yeah, I think it's a matter of time. Just a matter of time. Oh, I'm not going to sell it. I'm not going to sell it. Guess what? She's I selling it. Before I found it. Oh. The Cracker Barrel. Yeah. I didn't know Cracker Barrel had quilts. Because I never went over. Tommy usually goes over in that corner and investigate. Mm. But I, I've never really been down there. So then when I saw things up on the wall, I didn't know what they were. And then when I looked, I was like, ooh. And then when I looked yeah. at the price, I was like, ooh. Okay, well, these are, yeah. these are good. These are like, they're the kind you would get from the Amish people. You know, mm. stuff like that. Handmade. Yeah. yeah, these, well, we were waiting for, what, 20 minutes, so that gave us time to check out the souvenirs, mm -hmm. and she found the gingerbread folks, which I got for her yeah. last time, and then she saw those quilts, and I was like, oh. But I, I, I get it, because I'm, I'm selling enough stuff, I can afford to get what I want, yeah. so, you know. She, she's uppity up now, Yeah. getting her own handmade quilt. I wanted them uppity Negroes. <laughs> <laughs> Let me take my <laughs> uppity Negro <laughs> to Cracker Barrel to Cracker Barrel and get her a quilt. Yeah. <laughs>
take it on up there. This thing is heavy. Scooby-Doo socks. Twenty dollars for socks. Oh, look at you! <laughs> you can't stop the vacuum, can you? You got that motorcycle revving up. <laughs> vroom vroom. <laughs> About to break the the mystery machine. Vroom vroom. either but it's funny to watch we'll, we'll, re we'll rewind that one a couple times <laughs> you don't care Grating stuff, cock graters. Oh, yeah, make um, coleslaw and stuff. Oh. Hi, guys. He said that's not in the bag. That's the only one. So, this is the only one? Okay. okay, we'll go ahead and get Thank it you. then. Okay. Perfect. That's beautiful. Yeah. So that retailed for what was it, 150? Yeah. Let me get you a seat. Oh look, you know what he's missing? Got the big dually stacks, bull. Uh -huh. <laughs> no, don't be ladies. Yeah. Yeah. Here it goes. It was $150. Yep. One 
and it took sixty dollars off of it, which made it ninety-six. Well, actually, it made it um, eighty-nine, ninety-nine. It had six dollars and thirty cent tax. Yeah, so, so just under hundred dollars mm -hmm. for an actual quilt. For an actual real, you know, like the Amish people make. Yeah. Cool. Well, today was your lucky day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, all right then. I guess we're going to head on home so my girl can enjoy her new quilt. I'm going to put it in a duvet cover to keep it clean because I'm not going to wash it. No. Oh. I'm just going to leave it alone and put it, just change the duvet covers because I have quite a few. Oh, well. Yeah, Christmas is coming up and I have a couple Christmas ones. Oh, well. You're already prepared. Mm -hmm. All right, let's hit the road. Enjoyed the road trip and until next time, adios.